what we saw out there today is tribal youth, tribal elders, tribal leaders from the Yakima and the Warm Springs tribe harvesting Pacific lamprey or eels as they're commonly referred to. These eels, these Pacific lamprey are a very important cultural and subsistence resource for the tribes. It's always been said that when salmon populations were down you could always rely on the lamprey populations to get you through those lean months. Uh, during the year and in the past few years we've seen that reverse. We've seen lamprey populations decline um, but it's essential that we keep what little harvest we can going so that we can assure that cultural value and that cornerstone to the tribal culture continues in, uh, in perpetuity. <laughs> For the first time I actually went in there, it kind of surprised me. I was like, I didn't really know what to expect in there. Like there would be other fish, but I actually seen some yeah. schnooks in there actually. Harvesting eels to take back to their longhouses, to their tribal members, to their elders. Um, basically, they come out here to share uh, the eels that people can't get out to harvest anymore. Take them back to the reservations, take them back to their communities. These eels were, will last for the entire year. And they typically smoke them, cook them over the open fire, but basically they taste like a, an oily fish. What I enjoy about the youth being out there from the tribes is, is the excitement. The excitement that you see on their faces doing this, doing this harvest, and then taking the bounty back to, to the tribal community. It's one way that they're able to provide for their communities back at home. Yeah, actually, it's actually pretty fun. I really enjoy it. I heard they actually taste pretty good barbecued. 